An institution departed the University of Texas campus today. He took with him the best wishes of literally thousands of people. And all new at five, Jim Swift tells us he also left something behind. When we had our 50th uh, anniversary, everybody was asking me, what are you going to get for your wife? What are you going to get? And so I said, well, on our 25th, I took her to Italy. And they said, yeah, but what are you going to give her for your 50th? And I said, well, I think I'll go back and get her. Yeah, go back and pick her up. <laughs> it was a joke, of course. 82-year-old John Henry Garza and his wife have now been married 54 years. And on this bright morning, she walked with him past the guardhouse where he has worked for 22 years. They were on their way to one of a half dozen or so parties being thrown for him this week as he finally bids goodbye to the university community. I've had health problems this past year, and I've had dealing with my parents and a lot of stress, and I can go up to that guard shack, and he can fix it. He says, isn't life beautiful? It's just contagious. It's just energetic. I mean, when you talk to him, you walk away with a smile. I mean, he turns your frown upside down instantly. He wasn't always that way. Born in 1928, John Henry Garza grew up in South Austin during the Great Depression, hawking newspapers on street corners. I remember 1941, I'm out there selling Pearl Harbor bomb, you know, read all about it. He was on the front lines himself during the Korean War. I was ready. I said, Lord, you know, if you want me, I'm ready. But he spared me and for a reason, and, and this is one of them, is getting out here and, and showing what life is all about and living every day, one day at a time, and enjoying life, because life is beautiful. John Henry Garza is leaving that affirmation behind as he retires, hovering over his little guardhouse like some sort of aura, visible to anyone who really wants to see it. Jim Swift, KXAN. Austin News.